Hello my dear students, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Hope you guys are fine. So guys, I have an important notification to share with you all guys. As you can see on the back of me, there has been tremendous vacancies for all the branches, mechanical, civil, electrical and upcoming more branches for, for NLC Limited. If you talk it about here, first of all, it is a Navratna company. The second thing, if you talk it about the recruitment is through gate 2023 score. And there are two areas. First is thermal power stations and renewable air, energy area one. And next is allied services, which is area two. Okay, so basically there are different vacancies. They have bifurcated for area one and area two. For mechanical, you have under reserve EWS, OBC, SCST. Total vacancies, if you take it out, it's 36. If you talk about uh, mines and allied services, the total vacancy is 84. If you club both the areas, you will get 120 vacancies. Similarly, for electrical, the total number of vacancies is 109. Civil, it is 28. Uh, mining, it is 17. And computers, it is 21. Okay, so they have told you even the locations. Like if you go for area 1, it is in Tamil Nadu, Rajasthan, Uttar Pradesh. And uh, for area 2, it's uh, basically Tamil Nadu, Rajasthan, Jharkhand, and Orissa. Now talking about next that how can you apply and all those things but before that let me quickly tell you that first of all very very valid condition is you should have a scorecard of gate 2023. So no scorecard like gate 2022-21 scorecard is not at all valid. The current gate that is gate 2023 scorecard is only valid. So if you have qualified it with a relevant uh, score with a relevant score you are eligible for it. Now talking about what is the degree which you should possess if you are applying for mechanical you should have full time or part time bachelor's degree in mechanical engineering. Sometimes some people offer mechanical and production engineering that is also those students are also eligible. Similarly for electrical civil computers you can go in. Huh. But they have uh, imposed a restriction on this also that minimum qualifying percentage of marks in the notified qualification is 60% for under reserve EWS and OBC and 50% for SCST candidates. So make sure you should fall into this category as well. Okay, now all these things are given to you regarding the age relaxation as per the category. That's very, very common as compared to every other. Now, how you have to uh, talk about like uh, age limits 30 here, it is 30 generally in PSUs we opt for 27, 28. But here the best part is as per 1st of November 2023, the upper age limit is 20 for under reserve. So that's one thing you can say upper edge. So even if you're 29, uh, 28, 29, or if you haven't been 30 right now till 1st of November, you can apply for it. Okay, now if I talk about that, how much will be the pay scale and also you will be allotted grade 2. Pay scale will vary from 50,000 to 1 lakh 60,000. So round about CTC you will be getting around 30.32 lakhs. Okay, and apart from that you will be having medical treatment group insurance which is uh, not included. It is not included in the CTC. Sometimes in some PSUs they include it in the CTC but that's not included here. So you will be given residential accommodations. Everything will be given to you. Generally they have a townships there. Okay, when you talk about NLC. Now, after this, uh, basically, this is the uh, your salary as per your training purposes. After this, on completion of it, your salary will increase to 60,000 to 1 lakh 80,000, where basic pay will be around 60,000, and rest tax and all are given. You can check it out. Now, the most important thing which I have to talk it about that they have told you all the things they have mentioned to you, what are the photograph size, documents you have to submit to them, but make sure that here personal interview will be there. So, selection, gate 2023 score card that will be 80 marks and then a personal interview will be there of 20 marks okay reservation and all as they have told as per the government guidelines will be there and uh, basically after this if you talk it about after this you talk it about that huh, only Indian nationals will be able to apply so from Nepal Bhutan if every but anybody is there he can't apply talking about yes you have a bond here so you have a bond of round about 3 lakh rupees Okay, so you have to serve a minimum period of three years after your training purposes. 
after after training for uh, after training if you don't spend 3 uh, 3 years here you have to pay and you break the bond so you have to pay 3 lakh rupees okay other things you can go and uh, basically i'll share the pdf in the comment section you can go through this you have to register uh, your name mail id mobile number each and everything for what post you are applying for ha huh. this there is a non refundable amount of 854 rupees which you have to pay this will not be refunded to you and talking about the most important thing is the most important thing is about the online registration application so it will start from 22nd of november and the closing date is 21st of december okay and the last date of online payment fees is again 21st of december okay so make sure that you fill it i'll advise you that fill it now only why to waste for the last moment make sure that these all documents your image of signatures date of birth aadhar card semester wise mark sheets in chronological order that is from first semester second semester third semester like this copy of your gate 2023 score card if you have done mtech uh, your mtech degrees each and everything they have told you that what should be the size each and everything you have to uh, submit it okay so i think this is a good way Okay, uh, the good uh, job opportunity for you, thirteen point three two lakhs package, not including medical benefits uh, and HRA and all those things. So that's a very pretty decent, you can say, at the start of PSU. Okay, so kindly apply for this if you have got a good Gate twenty twenty three scorecard. And for more updates, do subscribe to Byju's exam. Thank you, everyone.